Well, you guys, this morning on the Ricky Smiley Morning Show, our friend, comrade, partner, my dumpling Gary, opened up about a private battle he's been facing. And now he wants to let his Dish Nation family know what's been going on as well. And it was a kind of bittersweet moment, y'all, so let's just check out the tape. Okay. Jesus. How you got that on? And all the yelling you going to came out there. <laughs> no, the receptionist told me she said she liked when I wear bright colors and bright enough. But those pants, girl, that's embarrassing. Yeah, well, your ass did, honey. You're going to be embarrassed today then. Look at what you got on. And I want to thank you. I want to thank the whole staff. I mean, all the nurses, all the people. It just was really nice. Yeah, so I guess, you know, words of Anita Ward. I guess I could ring the bell. <laughs> I'll ring you again. Ring the bell. Yeah. Yeah, so, yeah. Man, that was so tough for you, Gary. Yeah, so yesterday was, like I said, it was like a bittersweet day because yesterday was the day that I rang the bell. To those that don't know that I was experiencing or battling colorectal cancer. I've been dealing with it now for almost over almost two months. So I've been going to radiation and chemotherapy every day when I get off from work. And you've been taking it like a champ, because, like, I mean, we knew you was going through something, or, like, I knew you was going through something, but, mm -hmm. like, I just never asked. And, like, you kept coming in here, kept yes. chipping away. Most people would have just took weeks, months, or okay. yeah. just dealt with it privately. They, um, and they set it up where I could broadcast from home and what yes. have you. Right. But I just, I didn't want to stay home. I'm like, why should I stay home? You know, the little time that I do come to work and stuff or whatever, why stay at home and just look at the walls? But, Gary, you don't have to do anything alone. You right. have your family here, and we will love and support and care for you. So he don't knows keep things that. like this a yeah, secret, no. okay? Yeah, I know that and stuff, but I just still said that's just, you know, I mean, I, mean, I told a few people because, I mean, the people that I wanted to talk to, I told Brad. Brad knew about it because she knows this hell, but I told her. <laughs> <laughs> I said, let me tell Brad because she doesn't care what's going on with but you. But, Gary, it is important <laughs> that, that you come forward because then it might it might get somebody else to go get checked and it might yeah, save somebody's absolutely. life. Say, well, like, he went through it and he's okay. And I, for those who don't know, I mean, when you ring the bell, that means you are cancer-free, correct? Yeah. Yes, and That's it means that, you know, and you know, you went through, I mean, like I said, that radiation, honey, radiation is no joke. Yeah. I'm still sitting here now on Listen. a pillow. Yeah. I'm sitting on a pillow now because my ass is burning, but, you know, because <laughs> the radiation burns you. But, you know, but, hey, I got to keep on pushing, child. No, head crack, want to say something? What is the head crack? Yeah, like, I mean, you told the right people that you needed to tell because I'd have told you to walk it off. <laughs> yeah, I'm so, but... <laughs> yeah, so. but you got to ring that bell. We were oh, so glad. Oh, yes. yeah. Congratulations, Gary. Yes, we love you, brother.